ஹலோ எவ்ரி ஒன் திஸ் இஸ் பிரசாந்த் வெல்கம் டு மை சேனல் ஸோ வி ஆர் இன் அ பிளே ரைட் சீரீஸ் ஸோ இந்த ஸ்டுடியோ வி கண்டி சி அபவுட் ஹவு டு ஹேண்டில் த டெஸ்ட் டேட்டா ஸோ ஃபஸ்ட் ஆஃப் ஆல் வாட் வாட் இஸ் டேட்டா ஸோ வென் யூ ஆர் கோயிங் டு லாக் இன் திஸ் பேஜ் வாட் ஆர் த இன்ஃபர்மேஷன் யூ நீட் யூ நீட் த யூசர் நேம் அண்ட் தி பாஸ்வேர்ட் திஸ் இஸ் ஃபார் வேலிட் சப்போஸ் யூ கிவிங் இன்வேலிட்னா யூ நீட் இன்வேலிட் யூசர் நேம் அண்ட் இன்வேலிட் பாஸ்வேர்ட் ஸோ திஸ் ஆர் திஸ் வி கால் த டெஸ்ட் டேட்டா ஓகே ஸோ how to handle using a pytest so how the pytest assessing and helping us to handle this so first of all in the previous cl- class we saw about handling the uh, classes and functions fixtures in this i'm going to use the same concept okay so i'm going to first of all going to create a new python file new python file so we will go we will go from a scratch so this is data 1 so in this first of all we need to import the pytest after that we need to from playwright sync api in this i'm going to import the sync playwright sync playwright cool right so i'm going to create a first module first module def this is the browser handle so this is a browser i'm going to create okay so before that what we want to mention this is a pytest fixtures and the scope as module okay this is module scope in the scope i'm going to create a with sync playwright as p so in this i'm going to create a browser equal to p dot chrome in the launch in the headless mode as false after that we are going to yield this process this is after uh, the module this method browser dot close this is we done okay we need to give a two space that's why the white line is coming so right now it's gone okay so we need to give a two space so right now we need to create a function scope a def this is a page handle so i need to create a page new page every time so for that i am going to write a so first of all what i want to mention i want to mention this is a pytest dot fixture so what fixture this is this is a functions fixture function and this function going to have the module so which module browser handle module so i want to pass the browser handle page equal to browser handle dot new page okay in this i am going to create a yield method this is what after function so page dot close so this is what we done at the basic setup what are the setup one is fixture model fixture other one is Uh, i like function pictures okay here i'm going to get test case a dev test test invalid login invalid 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 login so this is my test case name first of all i want to give two spaces in this first i want to pass the page dot handle because we need to pass our page that is the first thing next how we are going to pass a test data that's the entries class so for this we need to use a at pytest mark not picture mark dot parameterize parameterize i want to give two parameters one is i need a invalid invalid user name so name and in and i need a invalid password okay this is a key okay in this key i want to pass the what data so i am going to pass a two data so this is a list in the list i am going to pass two values one is i am going to give a wrong user name password like add min because admin is wrong here because in this capital letter only but i am giving invalid username and password and this is 
and me so this is first invalid okay comma i am going to give another value so our uh, next one is like i am going to give a some small small uh, on, on like invalid values some some things okay see this so what are things i provided i provide two values one is this also invalid and this also invalid wrong test data okay in this what i want to do i want to pass this keys so invalid username comma invalid password so this in page handle is for creating a page and this to a data so i am putting colon enter page underscore handle dot i need to go to the url so i'm copying this url see here i'm copying this url so next step i need to enter the username so for that we need a this location so right click inspect on the element so see this it's a input tag it have a name as a username so i'm copying this entire part username as a value so control f so out right x path rub double slash tag name is input square bracket and we need to paste the at name equal to username so it's a one of one it's highlighting in yellow color so i'm copying this okay so page dot page handle dot wait for selector so i'm passing the selector dot type so what i'm going to type i'm going to type the page handle not page handle invalid password that one next i want to right now we need a page handle dot the password inspector so i'm inspecting this icon and going to the password so this is a value as a name as password so i'm going to copy this password value and going to verify yeah it's also one of one this is the right one i'm copying wait for the selector and dot type here what i want to type i want to type the invalid password okay invalid password after that what i want to do i want to click on the login button see this i'm clicking the login button and entering here so this is button type as submit okay so this i'm cop i'm going to create a new expo double slash tag name as a button square bracket at type as submit i'm copying this page dot page underscore handle dot wait for selector dot this is what click i want to click on the button click okay so we will verify when i give a wrong username and a wrong password when i click on login button okay what is coming invalid credential is coming so this only be validation so we today we are going to testing so i'm going to inspect this part okay this is uh, what is this uh, this part only this word is coming exact word so in this alert drop down in the p tag see this invalid credentials so i am going to in, uh, show you in the brush mark see this here only this text field but previously this text won't exist because only when i putting wrong now that time will come okay so here we'll take the expert but it's kind of complex expert this and all so what is role is alert right in this role alert inside there is p tag okay so double slash what is the tag name div square bracket at so role is equal to one of one so inside this div what is the tag name so double slash p tag see this we find it this exact expert so i'm copying this so here i want the error underscore message equal to page dot handle dot wait for selector so i'm waiting for the selector dot text so this will text content the text content will give the content so what i'm going to do i'm going to put a asset so what i want to i need i need this word invalid credential so this is my expected this is my expected value equal to equal to what comparing with the 
my current value so current value i am storing in the error message right okay after clicking as a if you are experiencing you know after clicking it takes couple of seconds to load the page and show the error so that means it's a waiting wait time so what i'm going to do i'm going to put a some wait okay page and handle dot wait time so i'm going to wait the 3 seconds and uh, we are the 3000 3 seconds so we wait for 3 seconds and we will do the validation okay everyone is fine right okay so this is we are going to the url and we are uh, typing the username and password we are clicking the login button and we are waiting for 3 seconds and waiting for the error to occur and store the error in this variable after that we are assigning with the expected value and actual value so you can ask question which is a name and which password na so this is the username and this is the password okay so you didn't got it right okay cool so we need to give a always after the comma we need to give a small space this is not a error but this is a good practice okay so that's it cool right this this and this okay i'm going to click on this button how many time it will run it will run two times why first time it will use this username and password uh then after that it will use this username and password so this is the good time of parameter passing so it will run how many different test data test data we give you based upon that those many times the same test case will run with a different test data okay i'm going to run it here run python test data so it fails not found uh, invalid login collecting 3 because admin does not exist okay here i done mistake uh, because this and all we need to given a same uh, um, both should be in same value okay so we need to give a uh, comma between the two uh, both the things but it should be in the same string okay to keep it but in the same string okay so i'm going to run this again so see this so it launch the browser first it will put the uh, first username and password did you see this wrong password in my credentials it passed right again it will launch the second browser this time it will put the another invalid username and password and it will verify that okay so this so see this totally two items were collected see this two items collected first for first scenario it will used admin and admin for second user name it will use the dummy data so both are invalid so both the test cases are passed it took 21 seconds overall time to execute this okay so everything is fine right so this so we need to use the overall steps okay so tomorrow we are going to study about the how to pass single parameter as well as i'm using from last couple of video you can see i'm using asset asset so tomorrow i'm going to explain more on asset why we need asset what are the assertion we do why we doing asset for this so okay so if you have faced uh, any issues please put me in the comment i will help you so if you like the video please like and subscribe thanks i like share to your friends thanks for joining